Man, these new games are pretty fun, but I don't know. Something just seems different. It's like, I have fun with them, but I just, I feel like I need to try something different. Or what? This is a little better, but not quite exactly what I had in mind. There's got to be something that I can really just satisfy my gaming needs right now. But what? This is kind of doing it. Something's off. I better try something else. Hmm. Wait a minute. A book? What am I doing? Ugh. I want to make a video on a game, but I just I can't figure out what to play. I need something fun. Something old school. Something retro. Man, I'll never get tired of that sound. It's finally time. I'm ready to finally play my first retro video. It's Mega Man X. I'm so excited to play it. What's up, guys? It's Benchez, and welcome to Go Go Retro, which is my gameplay. Just my gameplay of retro games. It's just excited to happen. But before we start into this amazing masterpiece, I gotta change my controls. Just clear statement right here. If you play Mega Man X and you do not put the dash button on the R button, you're not playing the game right. But let's get the game started. Let's get so. I'm so stoked to play this, you guys. I have no idea. Ready? Here we go. We got our hops. Shooting. Just as soon as I start playing this, I immediately just go back to thinking about how amazing this game was the first time I played it as a kid. Like the minute, the minute the music started and I started like just going through the level and just playing, I was instantly hooked because I was already a fan of the original Mega Man games. Like Mega Man 1 through 6 on the regular NES were just freaking amazing, super hard, and incredible music for its time. It still stands up today, much like this one does. But I'm just glad to be back playing some of my old favorites, and I hope you guys are ready to join me. Holy crap! Is that a bee? We got the long walker thingies. Kaboosh! And you go down. And you go down. Thank you. I can't tell you how many times, like, I've gone back and played this to the point where what we got to be again. To the point where we're just like, it's almost like clockwork. Like there's nothing really different or excitingly changed about the formula of this game. Like it does not matter what time of the day it is or what time of the year it is. I can always go back. Pop in Mega Man X, and I can just... It's, it's like... It's like a, it's easy picking like, throughout the entire thing. And it's never a challenge for me. Like, like, not challenge like, oh, the game is super easy. But it's like, I don't forget how I play this game. Like, it's not difficult to me. And in doing that, it just makes the experience so much more fun. Okay. So, enough enough gushing. Let's, let's focus on the game now. Okay, we make it a hop. We jump over cars because we're just awesome. All right, now this part. When I, as soon as this, as this just pops out of nowhere, you're thinking, what am I getting myself into? Ah, I got hit. Blast that a couple times. No. <laughs> I can't tell you how like how much this, like, scared me as a kid. I was like, what the heck is this thing? But this, it's, it's common in most, well, in Mega Man X. You, you want to beat Vile so bad in this, but there's just no possible way to do it. So you're just stuck. All right, here we go. We got the plot. Here we go. You worthless piece of scrap metal. Did you think you could defeat me? Well, he certainly seems quite full of himself. 
What's that? Whoa! Who does, who's this guy? Why is he showing me up? This is it's called Mega Man, not red guy with blonde hair. I guess I'm not powerful enough to defeat him. Aw, sad Mega Man. X, you shouldn't expect to defeat him. He's designed to be a war machine. Seems kind of confident. Remember, you have not reached your full power yet. If you use all the abilities you were designed with, you should become stronger. You may even become as powerful as I am. Get I will scout ahead and collect as much information on Sigma's fortress as I can. I'll meet up with you when we get there. See you later. X, I know you can do it. Well, he believes in me, and he says I can be as powerful as him. We got save codes. All right. We got our we got our list of baddies. We got Chill Penguin. Flame Mammoth, Boomer Quanger, Sting Chameleon, Spark Mandrill, Storm Eagle, and Armored Armadillo. For fun sakes, I'm gonna go in the route that I always go, so we're gonna start with Chill Penguin. Boosh, boosh, boosh! Chill Penguin! Yay! I think one of the other reasons why I'm so excited to play this again is just because I love the music in this game. It's so good. We've got Robot Bunnies. <laughs> I look at that robot who's constantly just doing the chopping, and since it constantly responds, he must just have, like, the, like, the worst kind of view on life. Like, this is all I'm designed to do. Just swing around and just more logs. Makes you feel kind of sad for that robot, but hey, what can you do? Okay. Oh, we got bits. We got ice cave bits. Craziness in here. It's just, it, it's one of these things, like, when it comes to, like, games, like, old school games or new school games, doesn't really matter to me. Like, there's one thing that I always look for when I play them, and that's the, if the game feels good. Like, like, as soon as you start playing it, you're instantly having fun. And for some reason with me, Mega Man games have always done that for me. Whether it be the NES ones or the Super NES ones. It just always fulfills that fun factor for me. Oh, more story. So, you've come. X, I give you the ability to choose your own path in life. And I hope that the world would allow you to choose a particular one, or a peaceful one, I'm sorry, I'm old. But now it seems that you are designed to fight. Because I was thought out the world might need a new champion. I have hidden capsules like this one. If you find them, use them and you will be able to increase your powers. Beyond anything the world has ever known. Step into this capsule and receive an acceleration system to boost your speed. Good luck, X. Aw, oh, yeah, we're gonna get our pimp shoes now. I can't tell you how my mind literally like flipped when this happened. I'm like, holy crap! I got new boots and now I can move faster. And just. Like, as a kid, when I played this, like, because I didn't know where all the armor upgrades and everything were as a kid, so the minute I got that, I thought that was it. I thought, yo, that's, I got, I got all the upgrades, I'm, I'm set, let's go, let's finish this game. And then I come to find out later that there are more armor upgrades for you, and you need them to increase your power. And the second I found that out, like, my little kid brain basically, like, exploded like the first time I saw Boobaroos. Like, that's how excited I was when I found that out. We got we got robots who throw weather elements at us. What what the heck? Who, who knew snow could be so deadly? Out of all things. Stupid snowballs! Okay. Alright. Let's roast this penguin. 
And just so you guys know, I'm going to do a 100% playthrough of this. That means all upgrades, all sub tanks, all heart pieces. But it's up to you guys to decide whether or not you want to continue seeing this, or if you'd like to see another retro game. Come on, chill penguin. You think I'm scared of you? Oh, oh, you're cold as ice. You're cold as ice. Winter fresh breath. No for me. Now I want winter fresh gum. All of a sudden I want winter fresh gum. Okay, it would be more helpful if I didn't shoot at the wall, rather towards him. Let's kill a couple blasts in the belly. Hop over. The dash jump is a thing of beauty. Dash jumping in this game. Oh. It makes it feel like a totally different Mega Man. And it's awesome. Stupid. Stupid penguin statues. No. No. Keep your minty freshness away from me. Here's a breath mint for you. I got some style for you. You're gonna eat this one. All right, here it comes. Blah! I missed. Eh, uh, tic tac. Boom. <laughs> like in most Mega Man games, I try to end like the final hit with like a mace, an amazing blast shot. But for some reason, I kind of goofed on that. The the wonders of the Let's Play curse. You try to do something awesome, and then it just kind of like blows up in your face. That's okay. We got an item. You get shotgun ice. Pew, pew, pew. And we got our code numbers. All right. Well, I think that's gonna do it for now. We got the first intro stage and chill penguin done. So next up, we're gonna do Storm Eagle. But I think we're going to wait till the next episode to do that. So if you guys want to see more Mega Man X, let me know in the comments. But until then, remember, this was GoGo -Go Retro Mega Man X. I have been Benchez. Don't forget to share, like, all the socials. I love all your faces, everybody. Keep on gaming. I'll see you next time. See you later.